<gasps> oh, mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. Do we get a fire brigade? Oh, geez. Nope, I can't step out the fire. I don't know. This is bad. I didn't want this to happen. Oh, it escalates. Oh, wow. That's awesome. It sucks, but it's awesome that they have this. Hey, everybody. Welcome back. This is Dad be playing a table. We're back with Pal World. I did do a couple episodes, just purely gameplay. I wanted to uh, have those who were debating about getting the game, couldn't afford the game, or anything like that. Experience what it actually is like, not just the highlights, the lowlights, the slow times, the grind. I gotta admit though, the gameplay of this uh, Pal World is, is definitely getting to me. Let's take a minute to talk about Power World. Um, some of my main concerns mostly have to do with uh, the... Is this going to be a situation where the Pokemon Company actually gets them to remaster this game into something that it's not right now because of uh, how closely it resembles some of their properties? That's a legitimate concern. I heard that uh, Microsoft's now joining teams with Pocket Pair, who uh, developed this game, to give them more server space and uh, help with updates. So it looks like the future is really bright. When I was uh, in my console days, I got to admit, I was a story player. So. Red Dead Redemption, Last of Us, those kind of games had the greatest appeal to me. Just because I got caught up in the story and I would run with it. Now that I got kids though and a wife who's a massive Mario fan, I've kind of grown to value gameplay more. And I was like thinking about it with this game and there's like two types of gamers out there. There's the story gamer like I was and those are just wanting the gameplay and what I realize if you're a story gamer you're probably gonna complete a game once if you really like the story you might do it twice so that translates into like 200 hours of gameplay if you're a gameplay player though you might be there a while you know what I'm saying so the gameplay of this game I do real dig all that to say is, I think the story of this game, I think that's one thing they should maybe focus on throughout the early access development is, uh, it is, is it is lacking story. Our character at this point doesn't really have any backstory. Our character has limited interactions with NPCs. Like, I don't, I'm not saying go full Pokemon with like tournaments and whatnot, but uh, I do feel like there could be a little bit more depth on our characters at this point. I got a poor guy who's stuck down here. And I built a. Can, can I save you? I just want you to come up, buddy. I think you're stuck. And you're hungry. And you're starving. And you're lost. And alone. Because you're looking into a wall. Probably shouldn't look into a wall. You should probably... Oh, wait. Yep. Quick fix. Boop. And... Boop. Perfect. You're not stuck no more. I saved you. I won't let you forget it. I like that they got the pals helping you out too. Like, that was a great feature to add. The best way to level up is, like, you gotta collect... 
10 of the character. Not just you discover you get a, a bunch of XP, but if you actually get 10 of them, you get a lot more too. And it took me a while to figure that out, so that's my bad. My bad. This building mechanic, I gotta say, is also another huge pro in this game. Uh, it's not just the fact that you can build yourself a wicked house base. But also the crafting mechanic for weapons and outfits and repairs and medicine and etc 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 there it goes on and on it's pretty wicked they got that really dialed in that really it's a nice breakup because if you think about it if you're in an open world game like this and there's no crafting mechanic it'll break, probably get dry the one thing i do wish maybe was a little bit improved upon when you got your your pals helping you with uh, I guess what would you call that um, mining and working with you they're not just a little bit slow compared to what you can do they're a lot slow so you know it would be nice if you could like, maybe that's a my bad. Maybe if I leveled them up more, they'd be faster at it. But it took forever for them to get stuff that I could get done. You guys uh, read some of the tweets where uh, PETA was getting involved with how to make a gameplay of it vegan? It's the berries, guys. It's the berries. Come on. I read that and I was like, ain't no way that's legit. Because if anybody who had played this game, they could have told you you could play it vegan. This aspect, I gotta admit, it reminds me of watching my kids play Minecraft. I haven't actually touched Minecraft myself, really, but if you watch the Minecraft gameplay, like, chopping through materials, I'm glad they added stamina. It adds a little bit of that realistic factor. Otherwise, if you got no stamina or no uh, weight capacity, you probably got the trees in this entire forest knocked down. And speaking of this forest, how about the <laughs> landscape in this game? It's beautiful. Like, the attention to detail is amazing. Ponds, trees, diversity in the winter section, hot section. It's just really impressed with the landscape. Man, I forgot how much of the little of the map I got pieced together. It's kind of awkward. Well, uh, and then when you first start in the game, it's such a slow grind. Like, that aspect reminds me of, like, Subnautica. Where, in order to get anything done, you're out for materials for a long time. Yeah. This, I just learned about. You can ride your boar. You know what I feel like this game could use? Oh, snap. Are you seeing this? Hookertes, help me out. I want this. What is that called? Ethel deer? This dude looks cool. Hit you with fire. I really should have focused more on weapons and crafting. Oh, ooh, critique. Ah, you don't kill him. Please, 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 please. I want him. I want him so bad. Yeah, let's go. Huh. Oh, wrong one. Okay, if I honestly admit how many of these spheres I've wasted by just accidentally hitting the wrong key, it's it's brutal. Ooh, critique. Action. Yeah. 
Let's do this. Pew! Whoop. Out of arrows. Should have thought of that first, too. Uh, keep hitting ya. Yep. Thanks. Eh, boom. You just ran right to me. Alright, now that those guys are all gone. I'm curious. In no way, shape, or form am I leveled up probably to be in this neck of the woods. Well, let's see what happens. Some moments you just realize that this is pocket pair they don't even care they're like let's build ourselves a massive pikachu <laughs> oh well, this guy looks pretty legit oh geez i am not yep this is not gonna go well for me Ooh. Jeez, you're down too. This is. Oh, yep, I got this. Yep. Oh, you poor guy. This is not going. Mm -mm. Home and shame. Hey, he's back. How was your day? I don't want to talk about my day right now. I really don't. I just want to have some food and I want to relax, watch some TV. I want to go to bed. Let's not. What's wrong with your day? Let's not talk about my day. I don't want to talk about my day. It was terrible, okay? I died like five, six, seven. I felt like I died ten times. I was so good at being a pal master that I came back to garden. Can I get you? Come on. Yep. Let this guy go. Oh, missed. Uh, nope, just let me. I'm going to go up high. You're a real strong dude, so I'm just going to go for... And I got... Oh, I can't miss. Low on arrows again. Yep, look at me. Hey, look at me. Yep. Let Hoocrates just wear you down. Or... Daydream, sorry. Let Daydream just wear you down. Don't mind me. Ooh, nice shot. Oh, you okay? Oh, wow, he, Daydream's getting low. Ow. Ow. You got it? Maybe. 13. Come on, pump it up. Never mind. And... <gasps> Daydream's down. Daydream's down. What do I do? Okay, you're low. Oh, missed me. Get me up. A couple more shots. Is that 3%? 4%. Let's do it. Come on. Get in there. If this doesn't work, then... Alright. One more shot. Still at 16%. Nope. Sorry, dude. Ooh, new faster. Moo moo. What's this guy? Fwack. Did you think about how that name was gonna sound? Fwack. Like, do I have to bleep that out? Part of me feels like I need to bleep it out. What the fuck is going on? Where are you? What are you? Like, legit, they got Nessie. Loch Ness Monster, look at that. Okay, that's something I need in my life. A Loch Ness Monster horror movie. Like, 
Subnautica, where you're ocean based, but you're fighting Nessie, but Nessie's like out to get you. Unknown worlds. There's an idea for you. Horror Nessie water movie. This building animation also could use some love. Uh, like if you look at this hammer, it's sparking off air. When I'm leveling up my base, it would be nice to get a little bit bigger of a base circle, if you know what I mean. All you get is uh, ability to do more pals at your base, but that's not really that's not really a reason to level up your base. Like, sure, when there's like raids and whatnot, it's nice to have as many as possible. But for the most part, it just becomes congested in that small area. Not gonna lie, I'm, I'm off with shoulder surgery right now, or recovering from shoulder, shoulder surgery, I should say. So watching this guy just flex his movement with his right arm is just driving me crazy. All right, you know what? Let's talk about what what would finish this game off. Like, what are some things that would make it epic for me? Number one, weather's always nice out here. There's like no reason to actually build a house. Like you could build your bed outside and you'd be chill. Let's throw some weather in here. Some rain in the tropical areas, some snow in the snow areas. Let's do that. You know, some of the animations, like I said, with the building and whatnot, they could just use some cleanup. Fast travel is nice, but it feels very slow otherwise. So it would be nice if movement was a bit faster. Mini map would be great. Like if I just had a little circle in the bottom left or square or whatever shape you want to go with. Make it look like a, the PAL sphere and just have your little mini map over there. That'd be sick my fort now you guys were very helpful hit the wrong button again key bindings not sure if i just haven't looked at that but yep i could use a different sphere throwing binding i've lost so many just by hitting the wrong button i know you helped Listen, I know you helped, but I also think you're adorable and want to just take you home with me. Oh geez, you're also stubborn. See those moves? Ow. You guys are wicked strong too. If I had a nickel for every time I had to come back for my stuff. Don't hurt me. I know I shot at you last time. Alright, now I got my stuff back so I feel all tough. Even though you kicked my I don't see any friends with you. Let's quickly. Yep, let's get you. Let's get floppy. Oh, ow. Come on. This time we got it. This time we got it, right, floppy? There we go. Switch up. Oh. Let's come on. Get it. 24. Ooh. Yeah. Rub. Rib bunny. Rib bunny. Rib bunny. A rib bunny. Hmm. Rib bunny. Oh, 
Oh shoot, it's a raid. It's a raid. Tokoto. Tokoto. I got no arrows. Let's make it fast. Hurry it up. What's a Tokoto? I haven't come across one yet. What do they do? Tokoto implode unit. Implode. Huh. That doesn't sound good. Uh, sounds like it might be an issue. Huh. All right, I got 10 arrows, guys. Hopefully that takes care of y'all. Low level. Can I get a head start on you? Whoop. I'd like to capture one of you if possible. Mm. Oh, I got no spheres either. Uh, get sphere. Start. One. Two. Require. Oh, now I'm overweight too. Hey, ow. Let me just drop this. Drop. Uh oh. Oh, jeez. You're like a bomb. No, no, no. Get. <gasps> oh, mistakes are made. Mistakes are made. Do we got a fire brigade? Oh, jeez. Nope. I can't step out the fire. I don't know. This is bad. I didn't want this to happen. Oh, it escalates. Oh, wow. That's awesome. It sucks, but it's awesome that they have this. I'm going to burn my whole place down. Oh, no. I don't want that. They don't have fire suppression system in there. I guess that should give you some incentive to make it out of brick. Wow. So, this is awkward. Those guys, pretty legit. Boom. I could totally edit out that fight and be like, I just made some upgrades to my base. Check it out. That's a nice space. That's a... Yeah, it's a real treat. Get a bed so I can sleep. Want it over here. I was actually hoping for windows, but I messed that up. It's not like this is my forever home. This is just my starter. Oh, geez, there's a battle. This is the battle of the two towers all over again with butterflies. We're cheering for the butterflies, right? Yeah. Boom. We're going to help the butterflies. And then I read it and I'm like, for the Alliance. This ain't World of Warcraft, yo. Oh, you're behind me. Why are you just running? Okay, I got lots of ammo. And I got my dinosaurus. My dinosaurus. Oh, ow. Sorry, I'm just so focused right now. Get him! Get him! Dino's doing all the work. Woo! Alright. Pew! Ow! Alright, we got this. Hi, little guy. 
Are you scared? Yeah. That'll be all for this episode. Give it a like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz, and I'll see you next time.